Yeah, bro, you've seen the title. How to attract her without speaking. How to attract a woman without saying anything. Bro, massive topic. Probably not spoken about enough, I would say. Um, bro, smash the like button. Drop a comment. It takes one second. It helps the channel grow. You, you are helping me out massively every time you drop a comment. YouTube pushes out the video to other people so they can see my content. Every time you watch me, bro, like the video, drop an emoji. It takes one second. And the channel can be 10 times bigger. All right. Remember, video dropping daily as always. So, and if you're returning, thank you. If you're new, welcome. I talk game, real authentic game. Okay, so. First one, eye contact, bro. Now, I've told the story many times. Um, you're sitting on the train. Girl's next to me on the train, sitting down. I will text her on my phone and I'll give her my phone. And then she will text and she'll give me back and we'll have a conversation that way. One, it's unique. Two, it's bold. Three, she's always going to remember me. Four, I haven't spoken to her verbally. That's one way. Okay. Another way, bro, which is more common, eye contact. When you're in the club, I'm talking clubbing because I've recently been clubbing. Okay. Shout out to Lewis. <laughs> recently been clubbing. Um, so how many times do you catch the woman looking at you? How many times, bro? Oh, I don't know if you saw my story. <laughs> a girl bought me a drink, bro. And walked off. Yeah, she was dancing provocatively the whole night, trying to draw me in. She came over, come and dance with me, come and dance with me. I said, not now, maybe later. I'm demonstrating higher value. You need to understand a lot of you guys, you make the mistake. You jump for the first girl that shows you interest. Shh, bro, oh, I'm not going to lie. She was a nine or a 10, that girl. But let me tell you what she didn't see me see. And let me tell you what she didn't see Lewis see. Remember, we're real Donnies out here. And I'm training you guys to, to, to think like the top echelon alpha, bro. As hot as she was, she was a nine or a 10, bro. She was solid, smoking. But I've seen her dance with four or five other guys in the building. But she hasn't seen me see that. Remember, I'm a sniper. I see everybody. I position myself. I stand five minutes. I move to another spot. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Who's low hanging fruit? Who's high hanging fruit? Who doesn't really want to be here? Who's happy they're here? Who just wants someone to talk to? Who's attracted to me? Mate, bro, there's so many sub sections in my brain, bro, I'm analyzing. And this is what I like doing. This is the psychology part of what I like about dating. Remember, you capture the mind, the body follows. She thought she could bait me in with that drink. Bro, she come to me three, four times, come and dance, she tried dancing on me, bro. I, t I told Lewis, I said, bro, talk to her. Because at, these, at this point, the point I was trying to make before I went on a tangent was, if I can shut her down, what are the other girls thinking about me? Remember, it's all about perception. It's all about leverage. It's always about demonstrating higher value. The majority of you, bro, bro, she's sexy. She's hot. She wants to dance with me. I'm going. Bro, I, sh I, I batted her off three, four times. Be very careful. Girls are always watching. Know your value. Know your value. Anyway, back to the video. Number two, bro. Smile. You're in the club, bro. Smile. Make the seductive eye contact. Your eyes lock your in. You can smile, bro. Gesture. Come over here. Come here. Bro, these are all things that I do. Nobody does these things. Maybe you've got a guy in your group that does these things. You need to get her attention somehow. You don't need to talk, bro. She She's on a dance floor. You're posted up, bro. She's watching you. You can see her see you. See her see you. You see her see you.
Bro, these are things that I do. Go out and use them. You don't need to go over all the time. Especially when it's packed out, bro. And maybe, as for the girl that I was talking to earlier, maybe she's shutting down guys. Maybe she just wants non-sexual attention, right? But what are you going to do? How are you going to stand out? Yeah? Think about it. Number three. Okay, so we've spoken about eyes. We've spoken about gestures and smiling. Number three, social proof. Are you social proof? What is social proof? Who do you surround yourself with? Now, I was in a two set of the weekend, me and me and Lewis, okay? But normally, five, six guys, we can roll. We can work. Everyone has their role, right? <laughs> and providing the ratio is good in the club, you can all eat. <laughs> tragic, tragic. But the point I'm trying to make is, if you're social proof, again, for the girl at the weekend, I know just the example is still in my head. If she's trying to game me, right? And a lot of you would have seen that YouTube video. I mean, the, the story I posted on my Instagram. If she's trying to game me, she's talking in my ear, trying to dance on me, bro. It boosts your value. Other girls will watch you and be like, who's this guy? Why is she talking to him? Why doesn't he want to dance with her? Get them thinking. So, bro, when you're in, when you're, when you're moving to the girl that you want, she's already noticed you. It makes it a lot easier. Trust me. Number four, probably my favorite. I, know, I probably just hinted it again. Number four, nonverbal cues, nonverbal banter, playful. I told the story um, same night with the 34-year-old. Who was out my boy was holding up free i was ordering the drinks she was ordering the drinks i tapped her on the shoulder she was to my left i tapped her I didn't look at her bro she's watching me she's watching me three four five I'm counting six seven and actually bro boys if i can just if the channel can just blow up i always give i always give my guys that i'm out with because we're always on the move, right? You gotta move from location to location, club to club, bro. I say, look, bro, you got two minutes. Two minutes to get the number, basically. And then we gotta move. Because one is cold, bro. We're in like October now. It's getting cold, so we gotta move, bro. We gotta move. I can't be standing there waiting for you to, to, to create conversation. We got two minutes, bro. We gotta move. Let's get warm. Let's get the alcohol flowing. You get me? But what I'm trying to is non-verbal banter, okay? Norm verbal banter. Tap on the shoulder. She's looking at me. She knows I'm not looking, so she nudges me. And then I nudge her back. Hello. Hi, you're right. Then she's in my ear. Yeah? Remember, they want to be spoken to. You don't have to force it, bro. Just be fun with it. Sometimes you can tap them on the back. Tap them. They're going to look. And then you'll be on the other side. You just need to create opportunities. Be fun with it. Remember, when you're fun, it makes things easier. You don't have to be always serious, especially at night night game, bro. Don't have to be serious with it. Be playful. Number five, the fifth way that you can attract women without talking. Your style, bro, your fashion. Do you wear chiffons like me? A chiffon is like, um, looks like a girly shirt, to be fair. I know a lot of you guys might get onto me, but I don't care, bro. You know why? Because they love it, bro. It's like a um, see-through type material. Um, but not too see-through. But I'm always blacked out normally when I go out. Bro, the leather. When you see me rolling with the leather, bro. You know it's showtime. <laughs> whatever, your, whatever your thing is, bro. Yeah? Your appearance, your style. Do you wear loafers? Do you wear boots? Do you wear brogues? I don't know what your style is, bro. Just dress to impress, I guess. Yeah, how do you accessorize? I have my bracelet that I wear. Um. <laughs> this is me, bro. There's no, there is no, again, you could probably say it's feminine, but I don't care, right? And to be fair, Pandora came out when I was in uni. Pandora came to England in like 2009. Bro, I was like, I was like the only boy rocking Pandora before it became big. Um, Shout out to Pandora if you want to sponsor me, feel free. 
Um, but I got the idea from the guys on Made in Chelsea, actually. Shout out to Made in Chelsea. Um, actually, I tried to... Anyway, that's, an, that's another story. See how I got, go off on tandems? I tried to... Um, there's a program called Taking New York. Um, they only had one season. Um, taking Made in Chelsea is on like season 22 now. But um, Taking New York came on screen when Made in Chelsea went off screen. So it was supposed to be like the stopgap. Um, I tried to go on season two, but they never got season two. Yeah. Um, I was speaking to the casting directors. That would have been sick. I was really excited about that. But, um, that's another story. Um, yeah, that's another story. But um, yeah, bro. Dress to impress when you go out, bro. Your fashion, necklaces, bracelets, all these things, they catch the eye. Yeah. And the thing is, especially what I've noticed is, is most guys will dress based on what's on trend. Okay, so what they see on the websites and what the mannequins are wearing. So more likely than not, most guys are going to be wearing the same thing, which, yes, you're on trend, but you're not really going to differentiate yourself. It's how do we stand up? Number six, last but not least, the sixth and final way to attract women without talking, bro. How do you post? How do you stand, bro? Your body language. I told you, in my job, I'm a sniper. That's my role. I stand on pose. I look pretty. Remember, I'm not a pretty boy, but that's my role. I pick locations where I can see everybody. And I move. When I stand a bit too long, then I move. Okay? Just so I know the ratio. So I know who's legitimately, sing legitimately single, who's a liability, who's been watching me for a while that I probably need to go over and talk to her. Okay? I assess. I download data. But that's my role. Then I've got my boys like Lewis, they're strikers, bro. They don't care, they just go. Okay? Then you've got the dancer, bro, who draws gals on the dance floor. Yeah? They're the guys that can move. Yeah? They move, they move, they move. And they're, at, they're, they're behind the girl and they're drawing the number, bro. One hand's holding, one hand's holding the waist, bro. The other hand's typing the number, bro. The man are dangerous. I haven't got skills like that, unfortunately. Do what you do best. I'm gonna make the video, bro. Six type of guys in a nightclub. I have to make the video. But um, yeah, bro. Smash, smash, smash the like button, bro. Subscribe, subscribe if you're new, bro. Use your non-verbal skills to your advantage, bro. You don't always have to talk. Be creative. Your eyes will get you there. Your teeth will get you there, bro. Use your hands. All right. Trust yourself, man. If you need coaching on it, bro, DM me. Drop me an email. As always, keep learning, keep grinding, keep leveling up.